Goring. The science guy. Mr. Goring. Mr. Goring, 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 Mr. Goring. The science guy. If I drop both ends of this rod, right? If I if I let go with both hands, what's going to happen? Both are going to ground. We're going to go both hit the ground, right? And right. bam, they they they're going to accelerate downward at the same rate. Together at the same time. They stay together, but. What happens if I just let go with my left hand? It's quicker. It yeah, faster. it's quicker. Um, the center of mass is accelerating. It's how the acceleration it's how of the end of the rod is negative three half g. What's the acceleration of the penny? For g. It's just g. This one is accelerating fifty percent faster oh. downward immediately. Where could I put the penny so that it accelerates? at exactly the same rate that that point on the meter stick is accelerating. Ah, two thirds. Why is it two thirds? Oh, man, you gotta reciprocate. Oh, you gotta reciprocate. Yeah, because if I want A to be equal to G, then I have G equals negative three, or I should say negative three, negative three to have G over L. Where is it? In other words, I wanna know what the R is. I put the L over there and divide by G, the G cancels. I get L, but then I have to multiply by two thirds, so I get two thirds L. That's what the radius is, so that it stays on the rod. Two thirds on a meter stick is where? 66. Instead of that 66, 67. I'm gonna put it on the 66, 67 mark. When I let go. But you should see that it's like not, I mean, it's staying together, like, unlike what it did at the end. Right. Mr. Goring. The science guy. Mr. Goring. Mr. Goring, 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 Mr.